Welcome back to the channel and we're back with our daily PGV update and today is actually claim day so I'm going to be claiming my rewards or harvesting gems today in this video but before we get any further remember the standard disclaimer here you're probably sick of hearing it but nothing in this video is financial advice please always do your own research and only invest what you are willing to lose so first of taking a look total gems have gone up slightly we're at 18.8 million USDC. Gembot still trading with 12.7. Total gems harvested up 7 million. And total refunds at 1.7 million. But you can't actually get refunds currently until all of the old contracts are refunded. So scrolling down here, we can see claimable gems, 487 USDC. You can harvest any time now. So we're going to go ahead, harvest these gems confirm that then of course i need to confirm it on my ledger which all of you guys i would recommend getting a ledger keep yourself safe in the crypto space this should not take too long and then we should have our transaction completed with a nice little harvest just shy of 500 dollars, which isn't bad i want to say this has been slightly over a week because their daily percentages got like delayed one extra day so i think that was like an eight day harvest so coming up to my account now we can see $5,000 deposit, harvested 2,781 USDC. So over 50% returned already, which is very nice to see. If we actually pull up a calculator, our percentage is a 55% return, which is pretty nice to be fair. I'll take it. So again, currently the refunds are paused on the USDC contract until the old refunds are completed. So if you're wondering, say you're attempting to get a refund now, it will not work. The refund function has been paused. But after all of the other contracts are refunded, the old ones, they're going to, of course, inject the funds back into the balance and then open up refunds again because they, of course, using the majority of balance to refund the older contracts. But I'm happy with my 55% ROI currently. When the refunds are open, I guess I'm in, there's like a decision I could make. Technically, I could invest, oh no, sorry, I could refund my initial 5,000 USDC and then say deposit the house money. So then I'd be playing with around 2.7 as house money or I just keep going and hope I can claim the rest of my 45%, which shouldn't take too long. Again, if we average it at 1% per day, that is only what 500 um 50 ish days if we do 5000 minus our 2787 that's 2213 and if we assume we're earning 1% a day which currently obviously it's been paying 1.25 but if we lowball at 1% per day that's $50 per day which means we have 44 days until we would have 100% return and after that point, we're still earning is pure, pure profit. And of course, I could withdraw my deposit for even more return. So it's it's a decision. Either I can wait 44 days until I'm fully home free, or I could withdraw my initial now, then play with the 2787, which at 1% per day would be $27 per day, which ain't bad, but I don't know. I'll see. Let me know what you would do down below. Again, the safe option is to always take out your initial as soon as you're happy and then play with house money. But PGV, I don't know. I guess I'll see how the trading bot goes because I, if I would want funds for the trading bot, I'd probably withdraw from here. But yeah, let me know your thoughts down below. What percent have you RRI'd so far? But now, if we jump into the Discord, we had a message from Manny, another one of his videos going through the refunds. So this video was pretty sure he didn't really show much on the video as we can see it's just a screen but basically in this video he goes through saying that a problem they have been having with the refunds is that the exchanges i don't know what they're using specifically but this could be binance etc they only allow you to withdraw a set amount of funds per day so for example say you can only do 100,000 of funds in withdrawals. And of course, there's a large amount of dollar value in refunds left to go. But apparently he says within 12 hours of this post, 
which is probably done by the time you see this video they have access to all of the funds and can withdraw them all which means the refunds will actually happen i guess because if they were saying it was a funds problem that they couldn't withdraw them all then if they've had access to all of them now the refunds should start coming in hot again he hasn't given a deadline if you saw yesterday's video make sure to check that one out if you haven't already that manny basically went through saying that he's not going to set any more deadlines he was sorry for i guess the inconsistencies and thanking everyone for their patience because there's been so many deadlines the first deadline was probably like over four weeks ago and of course that one wasn't hit and then the final 100 deadline of course wasn't hit but he said no more deadlines and that the refunds ideally he said would be finished by the end of the week do i think that will happen probably not i reckon two weeks depending i guess if they have access to the funds the refund speed should pick up a lot but we will have to wait and see once i guess the funds are out and he can start cycling the refunds another thing i want to go through is the old contracts as we can see there's no funds in here and okay well he managed to reinvest i don't really know how but we can see these red transaction reverted on people trying to reinvest and this is because again if you didn't see my prior video on the old contracts usd bsc usdt polygon and tron they're banning all of the wallets. As we can see here, six hours ago, if I go to view a lot of transactions, we can see ban wallet, ban wallet, ban wallet. Loads of them, which basically they are banning every single wallet because one, this contract isn't actually used for refunds anymore. They have a brand new contract they're using for the refunds. If anyone actually has a link to the contract, drop it in the comment section down below so we can track the funds on the refund contract in tomorrow's video but they ban the wallets to stop people reinvesting because there's whales in here with like 150k who have free forexed just from the reinvestment because again just from the delay in the refunds they're earning two percent per day i want to say it's been over 50 days since the first refunds were announced which means they've already 2xed just due to this whole refund process which is insane so it should have happened a long time ago, but I'm happy finally they've decided to ban wallets, stopping people reinvesting. I know in the Discord they told people to stop, but again, it's a smart contract. You physically can't stop people doing that. And personally, if it were me, I probably would have been reinvesting as well, not going to lie. There's nothing stopping you. You may as well take 2% per day if it's there for the taking. So yeah, at least that has now been stopped. But yeah, as Manny said, they're getting access to the funds today then they're going to start doing the refunds hard. So we'll wait to see for that front. At least I got my claim in. And of course, the percent were, was currently 1.25%. This is locked until tomorrow, and then we will get a new percent. So fingers crossed we can keep at 1.25, or it can go up. I have a slight feeling that it might go down slightly, because the well, if you saw the crypto market in the last 24 hours, it's not the best. But yeah, thank you all for watching. Hope you've enjoyed and I'll see you in my next video.